We're now shifting our focus to some visuals coming in from outside the Kochi University where we're understanding the Youth Congress is protesting outside Kochi University of Science and Technology over backdoor appointments. We'll try and understand what really is happening but just look at some of the visuals that we are uh, playing out on our screens. As I said, these are visuals that are coming in from outside the Kochi University. The people that you see on your screens are Youth Congress workers who are protesting outside this university. This is the Kochi University of Science and Technology over backdoor appointments. We'll try and connect with our colleague and a reporter to try and understand or what is the kind of deployment that we are seeing to ensure that this doesn't become a law and order situation? What are the demands that are being put forth by the Youth Congress workers? But I can already see some water cannons that are being used, some of them trying to jump these barricades as well. What are their demands? They are demanding and they are protesting against the backdoor appointment. So you can already see some water cannons that are being used. This is as far as backdoor appointments are concerned. You have Youth Congress workers who are now protesting outside the Kochi University or science and technology. Is this now going to become a law and order situation? Are we seeing police deployment on the ground? What are the kind of political reactions that we are seeing? And what is the essential basis of these protests? What are the kind of backdoor appointments that have been made? We'll try and get all these details in just a bit. But as of now, Visuals of those protests on your screens coming in from Kochi. You have Youth Congress workers protesting outside this university. They're protesting against backdoor appointments. Some sort of sloganeering and chanting that also can be heard. They're, of course, raising flags, some water cannons that are being used against them as well. I can see some of them trying to jump over these barricades that have been put as well. But we'll have to understand whether these protests are only limited to outside the Kochi University or actually are we seeing them increase to other areas. More importantly, what are the kind of political reactions that are coming in as well. But I believe my colleague Neetu is now joining us on the broadcast. Neetu, give us a better understanding why these protests and any other political reactions that are coming in. The protests are going on um, uh, by the Congress Congress uh, and the KAC uh, in this university's uh, issue. So, so they have been raising the issue of backdoor appointments and this is also a day when uh, Kerala governor is, has given time for this week. He has given show calls and they will be, uh, they are meeting with him at the moment. Uh, eight of them at least are meeting with him, uh, uh, giving their experience or uh, why uh, they are show calls. So that is also happening. Meanwhile, uh, the opposition is protesting uh, uh, appointments. Uh, their main uh, the issues that they have been raising uh, against the government is that uh, there are uh, 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 backdoor okay. appointments that are happening. Okay, Neetu, we'll leave the conversation there. This is a developing story. We'll keep tracking all those developments with that.